In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to easily import HTML objects into PowerPoint. If you're looking to enrich your presentations with dynamic and interactive content captured in HTML files, you're in the right place. By following these simple steps, you'll be able to embed HTML into your PowerPoint slides with ease. Let's begin by opening PowerPoint on your computer. If you haven't already launched the program, go ahead and do so now. Once inside PowerPoint, navigate to the presentation where you'd like to include the HTML object. This is a crucial first step as it sets the stage for all your embedding activities. Next, direct your attention to the taskbar at the top and find the Insert tab. This tab is your gateway to importing a wide range of multimedia and interactive content, enabling you to enhance the impact of your presentation significantly. Click on the Insert tab and a ribbon with various options will appear. Among these options you'll find a button labelled Object. Click on the Object button to open a dialog box that presents several ways to integrate other file types into your slide. In this dialog box you'll want to select the option that says Create from File. This option is specifically tailored for importing existing files such as HTML directly into your presentation. Upon selecting Create from File, the next step is to click on the Browse button. This action will open a File Explorer window so you can navigate through your computer's directories and find the HTML file you wish to embed. Take your time to locate your file. If you've stored your HTML files in a specific folder, use the directory tree to access it, ensuring you select the correct file. Once you've found and selected the HTML file, you need to consider how you'd like it to be displayed in your presentation. You'll see an option labelled Display as Icon. By checking this box, the HTML object will appear as an icon rather than as embedded code or content on your slide. Displaying it as an icon is particularly useful if you want to minimise distractions caused by lengthy code displays or overly complex designs. And that's all there is to it, you've successfully imported an HTML object into your PowerPoint presentation. This method allows for flexibility in how you present web-based designs or functionalities within a familiar and professional layout. Remember that integrating various elements into your slides can greatly enhance engagement and now you have the know-how to enrich your presentations even further. Thank you for watching and I hope you found these instructions clear and straightforward. If you have any questions or need further guidance, feel free to leave a comment below. Happy presenting!